Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is noun phrase 288. The noun phrase today is a punching bag. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot? Do it right now. Let's get right to it. All right, the first definition is the, the one that most people should know. So we're talking about the physical object here. Uh, a punching bag is an inflated ball or bag that is hung and punched uh, for training in boxing. Could be that little small one that you see the boxer in the movie always go like this while he's training. Or it could be the longer one that's usually um, a tougher one, one that might be filled with sand or grain or something. So second meaning here, this is the one, this is the meaning that we want to concentrate on more in this video. Person who takes out one's anger on or who is routinely abused. So that person could be like treated like a punching bag or they could think that, you know, someone thinks of them as a punching bag. All right, let's continue. The origin of the physical bag was patented in 1872. Of course, a punching bag is used in boxing. Martial arts. Yeah, martial arts, sometimes it's actually kicked by some of the martial artists, so not, not just punched, etc. All right, let's continue. Over time, the term punching bag was used for people who were continually abused. So they're abused like a punching bag is abused. That's often hit. All right, and we got four examples to show just how we use it. Uh, here's the first one. She divorced her husband because he started to use her as a punching bag. All right, now this could be both ways. This could be physical. I mean, the husband could have been a wife beater. He could have been physically hitting her like a punching bag. Or it could be emotional, too. Just, you know, calling her names, putting her down, you know, uh, anything like that. So it could go both ways. Number two. Uh, those late night comedians were using the Octomom as a punching bag. And this was many years ago. That was that woman. I think she broke the record. She had eight babies at one time. Uh, and of course, the, a lot of the late night comedians were making jokes for, for weeks. I think that they took a long time with this one. Uh, so in that sense, you could say somebody could be treated like a punching bag if late night comedians just keep picking on them. All right, uh, number three here. My boss has a habit of treating me like his personal punching bag. You could say that. Yeah, we are, anytime, anytime it comes up in class, we talk about punching bags. We always joke about, you know, if a, if a worker wants to take a picture of his boss and put it on a punching bag and hit it over and over again, you know, so let me know. Would you actually like to do that? Did you ever have a boss? You want to take his picture and punch it over and over again, or maybe some ex-boyfriend who broke your heart, you know, punch him over and over again. Uh, just let me know. All right, let's continue. Uh, number four, that boxer works out on a punching bag for one hour every day. So this is the normal one. Again, this is back to the physical bag. And the last one, you might hear somebody say, hey, stop treating me like you're a punching bag. You know, treat me better. Um, I'm not going to keep taking abuse or criticism from you. Okay, anyway, uh, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I uh, hope it was informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.